Okay, as you can see, the gun's complete. Sounds are stock, everything's on it. Showing it still. Obviously, I've had air in it over the weekend when I've been shooting it. Still air in it. So, it's going to be up with it one handed. You take the tool, it's like a, sp a socket spanner, goes over the gauge, fits in, fits in like that. Stand the gun up, and just, it should be only, hang on, should just be, oh, I hand, no, a little bit more hand tight, a good nip, and then just slowly, you know, really snare. See the gauge go down. Yeah. A little bit more. And stopped. Take the gauge out. There's no seal on there on the end of the gauge. The seal is actually right at the bottom. In the, I'll show you when the stock's off. The, the stock itself has an indent, uh, a recess there, so that's why you can't lift it over the top of the gauge. Alan Kate. Trigger frame comes off complete, one piece. Leave the bolt in. Smaller Allen key. Just in both arm bolts. The front one. Oops. The front one is shorter. And the back one, the back one is longer. Just remember that when you're putting them back together. Okay. Back one is longer than the front one. Back one, gauge, front one. And you just lift the stock away. Oops. Like so, the stock's off. And you're left with the action. If you look in there, you can just see. Uh, you see the weight? Just inside of there. Right, there it is. It's hard nail on, so you, it doesn't fall out. You just tighten the gauge up as hard as you can. Well, within reason. You're not trying to bust it, but just tighten it up. Okay, no, man. One thing you've got to be careful of. See these three pins for the trigger? There's nothing holding them in, just spring pressure of the of the, uh, the trigger spring. This here. So you, they can move around, see? I can push them with my finger. So if you're not careful and you're moving the gun about, they might fall out. There's three of them, They're all the same size. There, that one's already moved, see? I just stood the gun up. So just be careful, okay? An assembly is just the reversal of that. Hope it helps. Cheers.